What is up guys, welcome back to Dan Reviews, and today we're going to be doing another video for the Walking Dead television series Season 7 premiere video. Uh, this is a video that uh, when the Season 7 premiere aired, uh, I was going to do a video on it pretty soon after, but uh, I got so caught up with doing the review and just, you know, trying to think about what happened and just... The way everything went really distracted me in a lot of stuff uh, with the whole Glenn and Abe death. Because uh, that, it's just, when you watch the scene, right, and you see it in Rick's flashback, it's like, is that what happened? Like, you know, it's just so kind of unbelievable type deal. Um, but, you know, now we've seen the episode, and uh, let's answer the question, was it too brutal? Um, you know, yeah, definitely there are some things in this. That I think we need to discuss about the whole violence and the brutal and everything like that. So, uh, I won't keep this one too long, probably, because, uh, you know, I think everybody can say this was probably the most brutal episode of a TV series uh, they've ever seen. Uh, and I, I could definitely probably say that, too. Uh, it, it, You know, when you see, you know, okay, so first we have the aid death. Now, the aid death was, um, it was kind of... Uh, it, it wasn't as bad, you, you know, if you know what I mean. Like, it wasn't as bad as people made it seem. Uh, you know, that you, you kind of, you saw it, but you didn't see too much. You saw it from Rick's perspective, as if you were in the lineup and you were watching it. And, you know, first, okay, so he hits him, uh, right? And you see the blood come down his, uh, you know, uh, forehead and everything. And, uh, you know, and then he just gets beaten to death. So, um... You don't really see it. All you see is Negan himself beating something. Like, it, it, it honestly just looks, when Abe's down, like, after, uh, you know, he tells him to uh, suck his nuts. Uh, basically, uh, you know, when that happens, it just looks like Negan's just hitting the ground with a bat. Like, it's just, it really, you don't see much after that. So, and that wasn't even bad, because you just see the blood come down his head. Like, that's that's it. That's really it. So, when I saw that, I was like, oh, that's it? Like, that's really what they're giving us from the comic book series? Like, that's nothing like the comic books, and I was a little disappointed. Uh, but then, he hits Glenn. And this is why I'm making this video. He hits Glenn in, like, the head, right? And he gives him a, a big hit, like you said. And, uh, you know, yeah. His eyeball pops out, every, the whole bit, right? And uh, it's disgusting, I'll say it. Uh, it's just like the comic, though. And I think that, for comic fans, people will love that. Because it's ripped right out of the comic book. Uh, but, you know, and as you can see in this picture here, you know, even Rick's, like, just shocked by what happened, you know. Uh, and yeah, you see the eye and everything, and it's... It is pretty brutal, but, like, people are sitting there, like, acting like it's the biggest thing in the world. People were even saying, like, they should block this episode from the series, or they should, like, they should not pl replay this in their marathons, or, like, people went, like, above and beyond. And I'm just here, basically, to tell people, if you don't like it, don't watch. And I know, I know people just go away, so... You know, there there are, I've actually, I, I know there's some people that actually stopped watching it because of the season 7 premiere. And I'm like, well, you know, obviously you're not a hardcore Walking Dead fan. This is not a show about, you know, <laughs> like, like, seriously, this is not a show about roses and princesses and all this, this, like, fantasy and just everything. That that's not what this is, right? You know, and, uh, you know, people make it seem like it's reality. Like, I'm like, if you really think this is real, I'm sorry, but you're so stupid if you really think that. Um, and I know people are not going to like this video too much, but I'm just defending this. I really am. This is ridiculous. It's been months, and people are still saying they don't want people watching this. They don't want, you know their kids watching this. Well, you know, obviously there are some things definitely out there that are pretty nasty. And this is definitely one thing. But I mean, dude, you you seriously you really want to go there because you know, and and the biggest problem about this is that you can show someone's eyeball popping out and their whole head like being, you know, the way it was on Glenn, but you can't show like nudity and things like that. And you can't swear, like, you can't say the F word, you can't do anything like that. 
That's ridiculous. I'm sorry, but that is absolutely ridiculous. That's, you know, that's the stupidest thing I've ever seen. Because you can do that, but you can't show nudity and, th you know, like, other things like that that you have to uncensor. Like, you know, I just don't get it. I really just don't get this at all. Um, It's pretty stupid, in my opinion. I really don't like it. And I'm here basically to say, AMC, you did a good job with this premiere. Um, don't listen to people that are saying, uh, you know, take it down, whatever. Yeah, you did some brutal stuff. But you know what? You know, and also, there's even, I heard people from the comic book that read the comic book still complain. If you've read the comic book and you complain, there's no reason. I understand. And also, you clearly know in the finale that someone gets hit in the head and that their head is probably all messed up. How did you not know that this was what we're going to get? Like, you clearly saw the blood coming down the camera. You know, it's like, really? You know, just really? Like, I just don't get that. And I really don't get the way that happens. So, I mean, we see... A lot of stuff going on here that I just don't get with this. You know someone gets hit. You know it's brutal. But then you don't even show it. Or, you know, I mean, they don't even show it. And, you know, you all of a sudden, you know, it's just, it's ridiculous. You know someone gets hit. You know that that happens. But you're still sitting there moaning about it. And just complaining because that's what you do. Because really, I mean, you know that someone gets hit. How many times can I say it? You know, and it's like, I don't know, it's just, it's ridiculous. There's tons of different things about this that I'm so frustrated about. And, you know, we, it's not, honestly, it's, we've, you know, like, this is not the worst part of Walking Dead. Because we've seen, like, you know, someone's head get cut off, like Herschel's head. We've seen the slaughter, right, uh, in Terminus. And, you know, like, I don't know, I just, I really think that, there, people are taking this too far. I guess that's what I'm saying. It was brutal, but, like, and also, people from the comic book that read the comic book say this is too brutal. You clearly see the comic, and you're still complaining. I don't get you, if, if that's what you think. Now, for people that have only seen the TV series, once again, you know someone gets hit. So that's, that's not an excuse either. So, I mean... Anyway, I'm going to wrap it up here, guys. Um, now, let me know what you guys think. Uh, were you disturbed by this premiere? And, you know, if, if you were, you know, I mean, I do get you at some points because, I mean, yeah, it was brutal. But if you've read the comic book and you think this is brutal, you know, I just don't understand this. Yeah, you know, obviously it was brutal in both. But you know what you're going to be getting. So that doesn't make any logical sense whatsoever. But anyway... If you like the video, please sub it up below. I know people, some people might not, but it's just a video I want to put out there, and I want to see what people think about it. So, yeah, let me know what you guys think, and I'll see you guys for the next one. Peace.